friends welcome to my channel so um, before moving further we are today conducting a live webinar based on Elliott waves for our telegram members uh, my youtube channel is sanitar and if you have not subscribed uh, you can click the bell icon and subscribe to my channel and our telegram channel stock market for beginners you can join that this is not a tip providing channel and we are a, uh, this is a learning channel we share our learning and findings with each other and we regularly conduct free webinars so that our knowledge is increased you can join this uh, in fact today we are also conducting this webinar so let us start that thank you Uh, okay. Uh, so, uh, uh, if if you want to label this, can you tell me how we can label this? Anyone from the participants? Passport not fit in our meeting. Shall we you? I'm not able to get the passport. Hello, uh -huh, first is a wave correction. Which one is a this one? This downward move two red candles, big red candles. Okay. So, but for a uh, for that, uh, there should be one impulse or not? A is uh, yes. This is an impulse. Which one is an impulse? This one. So, wh what about this one? Can this be a wave or not? Yeah, this is also. This is a wave. Yes. So which wave is yes. this? Okay. So, uh, I mean, we have some rules on wave that uh, the retracement cannot be 100%. See, there is a 100% retracement here. Uh, there is 100% uh, retracement. So this is not a, so, so there is a rule that if there is, this is not a wave, then impulsive wave, then all this is correction. Okay, yes. so so we cannot label this one, two, three, four, five, or one, two, three, for that matter, because uh, see this wave Z, I mean wave first. If this is the first wave, this cannot be retraced hundred percent. Yes, yes. So if you start from this, what will be this? Yeah. This is an impulsive move. Yes. This is a correction. Yes. And this is an impulsive move. Yes. So what can we label this? If it is a corrective move, we will have to label it as A, B, C. Okay. Why can't we label this one, two, three? We can label this one, two, three also in downward direction. Uh, okay. But see, um, can you unmute yourself? Okay, so if we cannot label this one, two, three, is there any reason? Can you find some reason we cannot label this one, two, three? What is the rule of wave four and see if this is one, this is the first wave, one wave will be end here and this will be second here. Third wave is this, but you see this fourth wave is intersecting the first wave, right? Yes. So this cannot be labeled one, two, three. Yes. Okay. So uh, this, this is either now uh, there are, uh, let me first, uh, so impulsive waves we we have studied only about one two three 
four, five, and AC. But there, there are other impulsive waves also, like W, V, and Z. Mm -hmm. And for corrective waves, we have studied about two, four, and B. But uh, there is a corrective wave X also. And corrective pa pattern, I mean waves, we have only studied about A, B, C. But there are two more corrective patterns that are W, X, Y, and W, X, Y, X, Z. So in this session, we will study about them. Uh, so first, any of you can tell me what is a corrective wave? Definition of corrective wave. Corrective wave is a retracement. It's a re retracement. So is it in the direction of trend or in opposite direction? No, it is in direction of trend. That means uh, it is a retracement in the, um, the trend uh, continues after correction uh, no my question is that if one three five they form a trend right trend can be up or down so two yes. or four will be in direction of one three five and opposite direction opposite direction so this is a definition of corrective move. corrective move is not only slow but that should be in opposite direction if suppose from this to this what is the direction of trend if you are studying on this point and at this point what is the direction of trend uh, downward trend downward trend so downward trend and but this correction ends here right yes. so this, this is correction because trend is down and correction is in upward direction yes so this this is the direct i mean definition of corrective wave and you should i mean remember this only so now uh is there uh, this uh, this is quarterly chart okay three months i mean each candle is three months between this wave and this wave we have to see divergence. Is there any divergence between this wave and this wave? This is the tool. Uh, let me, I mean, no, first. Uh, no, the histogram is also bearish and the price action is also bearish. Once again. No, it doesn't matter bearish or non-bearish. I am saying that uh, is there divergence between them or not? This is this is one wave. This is second wave. Okay. Let me again. Uh... So, are you understanding my question? Yes. Uh, yes. Yes. Okay, so if there is divergence between these two, then this this will be A, this will be A, B, C. Yes. If there is no divergence between this and this wave, then this mm -hmm. will be known as W, X, Y. Mm -hmm. Is this point clear or not? But I don't see divergence here. In histogram also, the two points are high low higher and lower on price this is also. this is one wave this this is one wave okay and okay. this is this is the histogram for that so from oh, yes. for this wave this is the histogram yes so is there divergence or not ah yes divergence okay so which what will we label this Um, we will label this A, B, C. Okay, so this is A, B, and C. If yes. if we don't have any divergence, suppose this were like this, then this mm -hmm. will be W, X, Y. Is this point understood? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Okay, so, but the pro the problem with uh, W, X, Y is that if we have a structure of W, X, Y, there is always a possibility of W, X, Y, X, Z. Mm -hmm. So let us study that. Now, if there is divergence, right? So this is A, B, C. Yes. But if this, I mean, see, this point has, this is broken, right? This C has broken. Mm. So what does it mean? It means that, yes. uh, so it means it is now going for the fifth wave, right? Yes. 
so uh, what sort of fifth wave uh, i mean uh, five wave structure what do we know is there any five wave structure five waves what five wave structure you have studied impulsive and corrective see and these are the five, five wave either we have 1 2 3 4 five or we have w x y x z so which one yes. we, we can apply here is it wxy right right so we i mean this is wxy xz even though there is divergence but since now we are forming the fifth wave we have mm -hmm. to remove we have to remove this abc and instead write wxyz is, is this mm -hmm. point understood or not yes understood see, see abc is three wave but if we again are getting price section below this c wave then this means mm -hmm. this is fifth wave i mean this is five wave fourth wave and five wave structure but this mm -hmm. is not a impulse because fourth wave is into the price section of first wave mm -hmm. so this cannot be labeled as 1 2 3 4 5 yes so this is w x y x z is this point understood mm -hmm. okay so now let us this is since this is quarterly chart right so i mean each candle is quarter let us see now we will go one by one to the lower charts and see what sort of trade we are into and how we can label this mm -hmm. see recently you guys must have i mean sent some uh, labels to me and i said that is incorrect the reason was that you guys if if you are labeling this as suppose this is the first wave okay then the third mm. wave and fifth wave they must be in this direction only if this is going down then third wave should also go down fifth wave should also go down but you guys yes. were you guys yes. were sending zero to one there third wave was going up fifth wave was going like this so so that is a mistake one three and five are in the direction of trend if trend is down then one three five will be down two and four will be in opposite direction If one, three, five are up, that means it's an uptrend. Then two and four will be down. Is this point um, clear? Yes. Yes. Okay. Now let us uh, one and I mean uh, let us label this. So I am clearing this all. So let me clear it all first. So uh, what we have, what we know as of now, that this is W X Y X Z. Okay. See, the zero W X Y is complete. The X wave is still not complete. And then we will go for Z. Uh, is this point clear or not? Yes. Yes. See, when we write x, it means that x will be similar to something sort of this. So, do you think this sort of structure is there or not? Structure is there, but it is incomplete. What I mean that if this is the x wave, so this will make a similar sort of structure, and it will take a similar sort of time like this one. this part yes. look at this part so you can see uh, which uh, i mean uh, what sort of pattern is this corrective this is corrective but we have three flat patterns are you able to visualize which pattern is this expandable see that's why i was telling that you should only focus on this is not an expandable flat uh i mean i will draw this layer. so but let uh, first this point is clear that x wave is forming and and this is z yes so this is 3 yes. months let us let us move to weekly first so this i am talking about this so what are the rules which we studied Uh, if this is the first first wave okay for correction this is correction at w2x right 
W two yes. X is corrective move or impulsive move? It's corrective. What? Because X is a corrective wave. We studied about right one. I mean two, four, B and X are corrective, right? So now, what exactly is this structure? This is one impulsive move. Right? Is this clear or not? Yes, sir. See, let us focus on this structure. This is a corrective. This is a correction. This is the impulse. This is the impulse. So, so, so which which pattern is this? Now, is it clear or not? Let me draw that patterns again. If this is a A, then this is B, and this is C. Which pattern was this? Regular. Is this a regular? Yes, this is regular flat because this is not breaking A, and then C is breaking this. So this is a regular flat for expandable. Both of this A should be broken, okay. and okay. and this right. Hmm. Yes. So you should remember these. So uh, it, now we we understood how can we label this. Is this A B C or not? What are the rules for that? A B C. So this this wave we uh, for that we have this right. If we draw one on the MACD, if we select this portion, this upward, which is the uh, for that this one. This is the mag. I mean, histogram for this wave. Yes. And for this impulse, this is the histogram. There is. Is there any divergence or not? Divergence is there. So for divergence, what we name? For divergence, for divergence. So for divergence, is it A B C or W X Y? W X Y. W X Y is not for divergence. If the, if there is divergence, then it is A B C. Okay. okay. There is divergence. If this point is clear or not? Yes. So we have not to check these correct divergence and corrective pattern. Only the impulse. So this is one impulse. This is one impulse. This is the correction. Hmm. So the, between these two impulses, there is divergence, right? This is the MACD for histogram for this wave, and this is the histogram of this wave. There is divergence. Yes. yes. So we will label this A B C. Is this point clear? Yes. yes. But you can see that X is the Is suppose this is monthly. X is monthly, right? This A B C is in weekly time frame. Mm -hmm. See, suppose X is a corrective wave. Corrective wave uh, can can be three wave in the form of A B C. Is this point uh, clear or not? Are you able to understand this labeling or not? Yes, understood. And all all are able to understand. Yeah. Okay. Now see after X what what we have on the monthly. Why right? Yes. So this is a month. It means that if we have a structure W X Y Z on monthly, internally each wave will be divided into sub waves, right? So the wave X is on monthly. Yes. That is divided into A B C. Now let us see what this Y wave is divided. So how can we label this X? This is one. This this is one, two, three, four, five waves, right? So is it one, two, three, four, five or not? Yes. 
is it can we label this 1 2 3 4 5 or not yes this cannot be labeled 1 2 because this fourth is into the price directory of this mm -hmm. understood or not yes so what are the other see this is the impulse yes this is impulse this is correction all correction and this is a one more impulse mm -hmm. this is impulse this is correction this is one more impulse so what are the possibilities for this either abc or wxy yes so uh, i mean which wave is this abc or wxy so is there divergence or not this is the histogram for this yes and this histogram so is there divergence or not yes divergence there is no divergence see this is crossing this point no divergence there is no divergence mm -hmm. forget this one below i mean this part because this is the correction so we have to mm -hmm. ignore correction on only check for impulse there is no divergence mm -hmm. so this will be labeled as wxy mm -hmm. this this is clear wxy or not yes is i mean yes. is wxy a complete structure or not uh, what i mean by uh, what i mean by that is there any possibility of extending this we can get wxy xz right see abc is a complete structure because after c there is no other corrective structure hmm but if we have a wxy there is always a possibility of xz also yes you yes. at yes. the start we saw that if y was broken then we again again got xy xz right yes so there is possibility right we cannot now say that now the next move will start hmm is this point clear or not yes it means that after wxy there is a possibility of xz also hmm so but uh, for that what is the condition that there should be a correction structure which is equal to this x this x do you hmm. think do you think this part and this part is equal no for which first part is small second part is large yeah so this cannot be x right yes so it means that this is the next wave now mm -hmm. so it means this y is over after y what are we expecting this is the monthly y after y what are we expecting we labeled that at the start w and z no not w after y we, there is x w x y mm -hmm. x z mm -hmm. so now what are we expecting x. but just, just now you said it cannot be x again because the See, you are, are you are getting confused that is mm -hmm. now monthly structure is w x y x z is that clear yes and in weekly for this y we are getting a structure of w x y Mm -hmm. this is only y y wave of monthly mm -hmm. so if so we cannot get in that w i mean uh, xz it means this y is complete mm. uh, is this point clear or not yes it see on the monthly we will get five waves but for mm. for for this y wave how many waves are possible w x y there is a possibility of x but since this correction is greater than this it means that this y wave is over if this y wave is over then we will go for the next wave next wave mm -hmm. is the x wave as per monthly right mm -hmm. this is the x wave 
So now this X wave is going on here. Is this uh, clear or not? This is not clear, right? No, not clear. We are clear about one, two, three, four, five, A, B, C, and W, X, uh, W, X, Y, X, Z. See, so, uh, see, on the monthly, we have W, X, Y, X, Z. This point is clear? Yes. So for now, W, X, Y will go one by one. First, the W will, will be executed. Then, then after that, X will be there. Then Y will be there. Then X will be there. Then Z will be there. So for mm -hmm. each wave, we will have sub waves. Mm -hmm. So for the, for, uh, for the X wave of W, X, monthly time frame, we had A, B, C. Mm -hmm. A, B, C is a complete structure because after C, we don't have anything. Hmm. So it means that X wave is over after okay. C. Okay, this point understood. Yes. So if X wave is over, then we will go for the next monthly wave. Next monthly wave is Y wave. Hmm. So Y wave had a structure of W, X, Y. Okay. Hmm. W, X, Y always have a possibility of W, X, Y, X, Z. Yes. But this is not X, right? It means yes. this this is only W, X, Y. Mm -hmm. So if W, X, Y is complete and this Y wave is complete, what will be the next wave? After X, we had Y. And after mm -hmm. Y, we will be having X, right? Mm -hmm. This point is clear now or not? Yes, yes. So but this the, is not there, you say. This is not? You said X is not possible because of the difference in the length of the Yeah, periods. that is the, on the weekly time frame. Hmm. See, you're not getting this. Let me again. See. On monthly, we have W, X, Y, X, Z. Okay. Hmm. Now, now each W x y x and z will internally have sub waves so we started yes. our analysis on this x this was yes. a abc structure okay yes this y was w x y this is clear yes the one which i said cannot have x is this part yes so if we cannot have y what is the next wave Next will be again ABC. How uh, after this X, what was the next? Y Once we, there. Yeah, after this Y, what is there? After this Y, if X is not there, Z will be there. So I am not telling about this. See, W, X, Y, this W, X, Y, X, Z can be in Y also. Mm hmm. So I am ask, I am telling that this X and Z is not in this Y wave. Hmm. But there after, after Y, which wave is there? X wave will continue. X and Z on is, X time. and Z on higher time is there. There is no denying yes. in that. On the weekly time frame, there is no X and Z because this structure this structure, if you see, this is different than this. Yes. It means this Y wave, this Y wave is finished now and it does not have X and Z. Hmm. Is this one clear? Yes. On the weekly time frame. So if this wave is complete, this Y wave is complete, which has W, X, Y as a sub wave, which is the next wave? Either it will be one, two, three, or one, two, three, four, five. No, no, no. Just read this. We have W, X, Y, X, Z. W, w wave is complete. After that, which wave is there? X is there. Yes. Once X is complete, which wave is there? Y is there. Once Y is complete, which wave will be there? In monthly, it is X, but in weekly, I don't know. I am asking about monthly only. 
and monthly it is x right so that that is what i am asking i am telling that after y x way will be there yes so likewise you we did an analysis of x wave here right this x wave mm. so mm -hmm. now we have to do analysis of this x wave yes so is this point clear that x is not there yes you, i mean this is a complex topic and you have to i mean see this video again and again but mm -hmm. you have to understand i'm uh, first i mean there is w once this wave is complete then there will be another a, x wave then y mm. then x then z now we don't mm. know at now this y point we don't know whether this will be wxy or wxy xz in weekly time yes. frame yes but once we know that this is complete we will go for the next wave which is x wave x wave yes so now x wave also will have a structure of this so what structure yes. is this what we had here abc yes so we may have a abc or we can have a different let us analyze this if mm -hmm. this if this is the impulse this is the correction and no let me redraw it so this is the first wave yes this is the correction all correction this is one more wave yes let me again see we have one more pattern here which is the triangle pattern i have not studied i mean uh, i mean told you guys about this but this is one expandable triangle pattern yes expandable triangle is there okay so let me label that for you again there are five waves inside the triangle after this this will be the next impulse yes. so this is impulse this is correct so this is the correction let me this is a corrective wave and this is one more corrective wave this is the correction hmm and this is one impulse this is one impulse yes okay between hmm. between this and this is there divergence or not this wave and this wave very divergence there is divergence uh, what is divergence histograms are at the same level but price has gone uh, decrease so histogram no so there is no divergence histogram are not no there is no divergence yes so what will be this structure x y when, when there is no divergence what is the structure w x and w x z mm -hmm. understood or not yes we will have to see video again and note down the points then one will come to yeah, know the after difference. after z is there possibility of x z again or not mm. see why i am asking the length is more compared to the first uh, move no no understand this concept why i am asking that is there possibility of x and y suppose this is abc okay hmm. suppose this is abc once c wave is over it means the correction is over and now next wave will begin yes if this is a, this hole is a this is b and this is c so we can see that now c wave will be up right yes but that will be only possible if this correction is over yes 
see when the impulse will start when correction is over right yes so uh, correction will be over when correction structure is complete so one c yes. wave suppose it is the corrective wave is abc and if c is complete it means correction is over yes so that's why i'm asking if this is abc it means correction is over if c is complete then we can go for the next impulse we can directly yes. by here right but if it is yes. wx if it is wxz there is always this, this does not mean that correction is over right yes, because we be can WXZ because it, yeah at this point our, we don't know whether that will form or not hmm if we and now this structure if we see this structure is different from this structure yes it means this is only wxz yes but at this point when there is no price action we cannot deny that this can happen right yes it means that this structure is not complete at this point but if we go to suppose 4r uh, this session will be over so do you want guy, me to continue or uh, uh, i mean that is for the day you can continue so we yeah. need to we should read first whatever you have taught right because i think this is a very complex topic yeah this is a very complex topic and uh, you have to first practice also because uh, is i mean are the patterns clear that if there is no divergence then this is wxy and if there is divergence then abc that's why, the notes and send you yeah that's why i was always asking you to focus on these because you think that you have actually learned the corrective part but there is always a gap right see when i'm asking at run time whether which no, pattern no, is no. this you are not able to tell me so you are always because interesting part is how to mark those impulses right that is interesting but the, the correction part is the most difficult and that is we should focus because most of the time market is in correction only uh, let me clear this suppose this all this is all a correction only but you can see there is part impulse then some correction then imp, but in total this is just a correction yes so so we don't uh, you don't want a i mean follow session right you want to first learn this no not today but yeah so uh, i mean on the basis of this video you can watch this again and again and then you can send your charge to me then we can have a follow up session and i mean in the meantime you can also do the same sort of analysis on your charts mm hmm because there was a problem in uh, i mean labeling the impulse last time when you said uh, for that godrej agrovet that was a wrong impulse on that so you can correct yourself on that and then apply these concepts here if you can suggest some uh, supporting literature it will be helpful so for elliot waves you uh, there is a uh, let me send some i mean uh, authors but i don't think you will able to get from that so i will send some names or if there are some notes uh, if you can send that will be helpful the notes are the, i mean whatever i am speaking are the notes that there is you want to know the practically not the theoretically if go by theory you will not be able to do this mm -hmm. so i am stopping here because i think the session i mean time it will stop so let let me stop it here okay 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 thank okay. you Thank you. Yeah.